Hello guys, <clears throat> sorry, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be sh showing you how to get wind shear. Uh, skip matter, Pff, I don't know how to pronounce it. As you can see, it does 24 base damage, but when you legendary it, if you have enough, it's pretty fucking strong. So if you have the smithing seals, I really suggest smithing it to legendary, because it's generally not that strong, but it does have a cool enchantment. It... Um, when attacks it, bash attacks, it has a chance to knock your enemy down, so, as you can see, when it's fully enchanted, you can one-hit kill the ebony warrior, so, you know, it's pretty strong, and here is it on my weaker character, it doesn't do that base damage, but if you have the smithing skills, I really suggest smithing it, so it's stronger doesn't do that much damage if you don't so those widgets over on the side of my screen uh i'm sorry there when i do voiceovers of stuff they go there it's really annoying uh oh yeah and you have to do do to this place called dorithiath you can go to solitude and easily get there by marking it on your map it's actually not not too hard to get and if you have a high enough sneak skill you won't even need to deal with anyone you'll just go on board and just kill everyone and you know well you're out of there so yeah it's not it's a pretty strong weapon and it's not too hard as you can see my first try here was kind of a fail um um, but my second try, I decided to use a different character. Is actually, I, I did okay. And you just have to go in this little hatch on the side of the boat, right here. And once you're done getting in, which it shouldn't take you too long to get in, um... You're just gonna go through the boat. It, there's gonna be a few guys waiting here before you. And if you're wondering what type of mods I'm using, um, um, I'm actually playing it on a PC, so I'm gonna have better mods than other play um, and console users and stuff. So I'm playing it on an, a Mac, so you know. I'd personally rather a PC. This, this isn't the point. Okay, you want to want to come up here to the deck area, and then if you have a high enough sneak skill, you can just sneak around everyone. Well, you're gonna have, have to kill one person, which is that guy right there. I didn't want to get detected by him, so I decided to come around, take out my bow, and just you know, shoot him in the back. Sorry about the zoom in part. Um, I'm not that good at editing. I messed something up while I was editing. If you guys know any good editing systems for a Mac, just let me know down in the comments below. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to come up here. And um, it's not too hard to find. It's like right here. It's actually, if you didn't, it would be, like, hard to find if you didn't decide to climb all the way up there. Guys, thanks for watching, and, um, you know, w ah, I already forgot the name of the sword. But it will be in the title, and I'm doing this because of my friend he actually has his own channel on youtube i want to give him a quick shout out um his name is king 10 fox and i'm not sure if he'd like me sharing his name but he probably could tell you if you ask him on one of his comments in the video and i know king Ton fox is going to be watching this video right now and i would just like to say thank you for this video idea i 
haven't been posting that often and I'm gonna try to do more Skyrim videos and stuff like mod reviews but anyways thanks for watching Frank 31 out